Um, my name's Holly Murray and I am uh, working with the Bhopal Medical Appeal on their fabulous pitch at Glastonbury Festival 2011 this year. Um, I'm the kind of creative artistic overseer of what's going on and uh, we've got a fabulous team of volunteers and litter pickers and there's lots of people taking part and it's uh, so we can create a really fabulous uh, beautiful garden that people can come and relax in and share and join in. It's been inspired by an Indian sculptor called Nek Chand who um, has created a beautiful sculpture park in Chandigarh which is north of Delhi and he started making it out of rubbish and bits that he'd found and he um, started creating sculptures and then he was kind of discovered by the authorities and they were saying but you don't own the land, you don't have permission and they're going to flatten it all and then somebody went actually this is a really beautiful thing and it's you know, a, 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 could be a very shared, lovely experience. So they gave him some land and they gave him some helpers and some volunteers. And it's now become the beautiful rock gardens of Chandigarh. And apparently it's the second most visited tourist attraction in India after the Taj Mahal. So it's a very popular, shared experience. And people obviously get a lot of pleasure from going to see and experience and, and share share the wonderful stuff that he's done. So we are making a beautiful garden using recycled materials. We're going to have hundreds of beautiful uh, kind of big blossoming chrysanthemum and marigold uh, flowers made from uh, orange Sainsbury's plastic bags, all laid up and fluffed out. And um, and we're also using lots of plastic bottles that we're cutting in half, and we're layering up with la beautiful coloured layers of uh, plastic bags and recycled uh, textiles and materials and fabrics and um, we're kind of keeping a bit of a colour theme going and when they're lit from behind they glow beautifully they're kind of a little bit stained glassy, a little bit jewel like and we're just going to layer those up into kind of human representation uh, kind of, so it, it stands as a bit of a um, representation of the people of Bhopal and the families that are still continuing to be affected by what's going on today.